What's up everyone, Matt here from the Tech Corner, and as a former cooking teacher, I can tell you I've made many, many corny jokes about food, eggs in particular. So let me ask you one, would you like to be an egg explorer? No seriously, would you like to be an egg explorer? So this was just sent to me by a company by Tenergy, so thank you Tenergy for sending this my way, and this is supposed to be an egg-shaped drone, so I'm super excited, so let's check out the box real quick and then open this thing up and check it out. So like I said, this is the Egg Explorer. I wasn't kidding. And here's a picture of it. It's supposed to be a foldable egg-shaped drone. So, so let's open it up. Wow, that's actually really small. So this is the whole thing. All right, it fits in my hand, it's like a little egg. Now this is meant to be a toy drone. This is not a camera drone or any of the bigger ones. So how this flies, I'm not quite sure. I have flown a couple of drones that were this small, but uh, this is actually really light. Let's see what else is inside. So you got a lot of foam padding. And there you go, you pull this out. And here you get the charging cable and mini screwdriver. Extra little propellers, look how small those are. You get a controller, which is cool so you're not using your phone. The joysticks feel pretty good, buttons are really clicky, batteries are not installed. But let's take a look at this drone. You get instruction, and of course you get an instruction manual to figure out how to make it work. So let's take this little band off, see the drone itself. So you push the on button and out comes the wings. And to close it, you have to be pretty careful. You have to line up all of the propellers so that they fit right inside. But to open it, all you gotta do is push it and there you go. Okay, so let's go take this outside and see how it flies. Okay, so once you've opened up the wings, to the Egg Explorer, basically what you're gonna wanna do is then turn it on, so hold down the buttons until it is red on the inside, not sure if it picks it up. Then go ahead, after you've installed the batteries, turn on the controller, push up, push down, and it should connect. The top button here is going to allow the propellers to move. This goes up, this allows you to move. Okay, so after flying the Explorer, what do I think of it? Well, out of the box, it is probably the best flying small toy drone that I've played with. There were a couple of drones that I played with I was gonna do videos for, but I didn't because they weren't that great. They were really squirrely. I just couldn't even get them controlled for enough time to use the trim to make those fine tunings to make it fly right. So I ended up returning them. I really didn't wanna make a video about a bad product, so I ended up not making those. But out of the box, this flies really, really well. As you were able to tell, it did move a bit, but some of that time I was actually trying to make small adjustments to the trim and it did a pretty good job. I didn't bump into anything for once, so maybe I'm getting better at flying drones, but that actually really helped and it stayed up pretty well and it landed pretty nicely. I think the landing base of it is just a little bit too small for it to just land quite like that, but it does a pretty good job and it stayed on the table, so I can't really complain too much. So if you're looking for a toy drone that can fit in your pocket and flies pretty well, go ahead and check out the Tenergy Egg Explorer. But if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions about the Explorer, go ahead and leave them down in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you can see more videos like this and enter giveaways like my July giveaway and my Blackberry Key One case giveaway, both going on right now. So this has been Matt here at the Tech Corner. Thanks for watching everyone and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.